A few years ago, we were the first to show you the new Tempo Walk Follow Me Robot Caddy from Club Car. Well, now they're back with version 3, and this thing is amazing. Stick around. and welcome into a really special product showcase. I'm Bill Hobson, it's great to have you with us. We are at the PGA Show Demo Day, which a few years ago is exactly where we first introduced you to the amazing technology that is the Tempo Walk from Club Car. This robot, Follow Me Caddy, in its first iteration was pretty darn cool. And now we come back to version three and it is sleeker than ever before. Ted Nicola, product manager here, Take us on a little guided tour of this thing while I, while I just stand back and admire it. <laughs> well, thank you, Bill, and as your, your crew already knows, you were one of the first people to ever get to see this thing in action about five years ago. And so now, once again, you get to be one of the first people to see it, the newest unveiling of the 3.0. Man, it is so, sharp. Thank you. Uh, we, we put a lot of hard work into this and all our learnings for about five years, and you got to see some of the first one, which we're real excited about that product. It's been a fun, fun product to get in people's hands, get them out there walking the course is what you've got to experience. And we've took all those learnings and dumped them into this 3.0. I'm going to go for a walk while you keep yes, talking about what makes 3.0 so special because it is quite remarkable. There's a little transmitter on my belt with a toggle switch. That toggle switch is what you will turn on and off when you have decided it's time to stop and hit a shot. But otherwise, without touching the toggle switch, it stops. It gives me a comfortable safe space so I don't have to worry about getting run over. What we did is we actually made it more narrow. We added a Bluetooth speaker for the fun component. Uh, we actually, we added some thing, just some little things like the cooler lids. So now you can store all your beverages. On the opposite side, there's a nice storage for your cell phone also with the lid. Uh, we moved, for the course, we moved their charge port for easier charging. It's up higher now. Some little small, small details. We took, and actually that front tire is now a run flat. So we, we, okay. we're trying to minimize some of the maintenance on the course, yeah. speed things up in the cart barn. So that is a run flat tire, never have to worry. Well, let's talk about some of the dimensions because uh, with the first iteration, when I would go to put it in my car, it's pretty heavy. Yes, sir. And it was a little bit wide, so it was a tight fit. You've now narrowed things up and it's lighter. Yeah, we, we put it, we put the 2.1 on a diet. Uh, we took it about down about 20 pounds and there, there's a really a good balance. You can't make it too light because as you said, the terrain, you have to keep yeah. that center gravity because you've got to experience it. It's very stable. People often question hills, terrain. So you, you can't make it too light, but then you can't make it too heavy for that guy that wants to throw it in the back of their car. Well, another aspect I think of this version 3.0 is that it's become, because the technology has continued to evolve, it's become even more affordable for individuals, for consumers, along with clubs. The price is getting to that, that tipping point, and it's not just for the, the elite anymore. We could actually, individuals can own this product. Okay, how long is a single battery charge gonna get me if I'm out walking? On a, on a pretty typical course, even the longer courses, like we're on a Torrey Pines, it can do 36 holes at a, at a very long course like Torrey Pines. It's lithium battery technology, so it's, they're, you're not doing any maintenance on the battery. Once again, it's a plug it in at night. You're good in the morning for 36 holes. Lots of storage on here. You've got the thoughtfulness of the Bluetooth component. Yes, We've got uh, an easy plug in now because it used to be a little bit cumbersome to have to find the charging port. Clubs are strapping in with a more traditional cart strap so they're nice and secure. Yeah. And um, we learned that from the last one. Some certain bags didn't fit the last. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. I mean, they, they would still hold this, we've just improved that. We added a double strap now. We've added the, the back, so now the clubs actually fit into a cavity. Yeah. We've, we've learned. <laughs> it's fantastic, man. Version three is as sleek as they come, and you, uh, I, I can guarantee you they will be popping up all over, not just my part of the country, <laughs> but all over the world. If you're going to take up the challenge of walking when you golf, which you really should be doing if you're physically able, there's no better way to do it than with the Tempo Walk from Club Car. So thanks again for the reintroduction to version three. <laughs> Bill, always a pleasure. Thank you so much. And our team's very excited to get this product out there.